This is the Wise Quick in Warframe and today the Ash Prime and how to use him. And this Prime is beautiful because this is a real ninja. He got all the skills. He got the shooter gun, he can disappear. But we first need to know where to get all his blueprint parts. Well he got it. I put it in big giant white letters so that everybody can see it and can get it. But now for the build. And as you can see on the left hand side, it has a lot of strength and almost no duration. Oh, you can see what mods I used for the strength. I got the Blind Rage, Intensify and the Transient Fortitude. And you can see the Fleeting Expertise right there. I got Flow and Rage of course when I get hurt. I get all my energy and I can use my Blade Storm or my Smoke Screen. And Vitality helps with that. But, if you want to disappear for a little longer, I got another build for you. Look at this. I got duration for a little bit more than 100%. So, you'll be invisible for 8 seconds or so. Uh, so, and there you go. Constitution and prime con continuity instead of streamline and transient fortitude. That brings us to our first ability, the Shuriken. This is where Ash throws his shuriken to his enemy dealing slash damage and the more power strength you got the higher the damage and because of the slash damage your enemies will bleed out for a couple of seconds it is a fast ability and an easy ability you can kill enemies with it or you can just cripple them for a couple of seconds this ability is very handy The second ability is called Smoke Screen. This is where the S Prime will throw a smoke bomb on the ground and disappear for a couple of seconds. So this is the true ninja. First up, Shuriken. Second up, Smoke Screen. Isn't that great? But with this build, the Smoke Screen lasts for, I think, about one second. So use the second build if you want some more time to be invisible. The third ability is called Teleport. This is where you bring your ash as close as possible to your enemies by a teleportation and your enemies will get staggered and they are vulnerable to a finisher attack. You can use this ability whenever you want. For instance, if you see an enemy at long range and you want to be quicker at him, just use this teleportation technique and you will teleport behind him and you can finish him off very easily. And last but not least, the Blade Storm, the ultimate ability where the ass goes on a rampage, teleporting to and destroying nearby enemies. Damage is affected by Power Strength, which I got a lot of, Steel Charge, which is equipped, and the Combo Counter Multiplier. And the more Power Strength you got, the higher the finisher damage is, and the easier you can kill all the enemies surrounding you. The only thing you need to do is point at one of the enemies surrounding you and use your ultimate ability and your ash will be so kind to search all the other enemies for you. And as you can see here, even high level enemies are no match for my ash prime. Now sit back and relax and let's see how much damage the ash prime can inflict upon his enemies. Here ladies and gentlemen, you can see that the Ash teleports to a Bombard, killing him, then continuing his, his attack by using his Blade Storm. And this is how the Ash works. You can just seemingly use all your abilities after another. And look how beautiful it looks. The Ash Prime is the true ninja. Here we are at a investigation defense mission and um, I wanted to show you that it is very easy 
to use your airstrike to to do these kinds of missions because look at here i'm just standing on top of this thing here and using my blade storm i don't even have to move this is how lazy you can get with the s prime ladies and gentlemen you don't even have to move anymore just use one button click that's it Sometimes you need to be a little bit careful using your blade storm ability because it can happen that you suddenly disappear under the ground and you get something a little bit like this. At first it looks a bit scary but as always the Ash Prime knows his way back and no one can stop him. Look at this. There we go. And back to action. There we go ladies and gentlemen, DS Prime, I hope you enjoyed it, check me out on all my other videos and I hope to see you there. And until then, adios. Oh here we are in a dangerous mission, only flying, look how beautiful the Sephir is, only flying, there are no enemies inside because she is too fast, too fast for all their asses. And oh she died, we're all serious now, look at this, we got a big flipping map. And now you can see the Zephyr only flying. It is hard, ladies and gentlemen. You need practice. Practice like the master I am and have some fun. I hope you enjoyed it.